TBD Brewing is a startup which is founding a microbrewery in Somerville, which channels its profits into running a unique accelerator program. The accelerator program called the Cool Ship, which is a word for a Belgian open fermentation vessel which takes in spontaneous yeast from the wind. The startup incubator called the Cool Ship is designed to take scientists and engineers in teams from MIT and Harvard and allow them to develop technology in fermentation from prototype to deployment on the market. Our friends in science rigging up water heaters with welded fixtures and building all kinds of crazy inventions to do the stuff they love, which often was home brewing and, uh, and essentially at home science projects, whether it's brewing or distilling or, or doing weird little one-off cheese experiments, all sorts of random fermentation projects. A lot of these projects, they were ready to turn these things into startups and ready to form startups that would bring awesome new technology to market, but they weren't really facilitated um, in their labs to do this kind of research. And so we wanted to create a space which was effectively a bridge between the passionate projects that they were pursuing in their houses and the sort of advanced technology and advanced mentorship and skills that they had access to in their labs. It will be a retail level brew house and underneath with a key card access a expanding lab space where people are coming in to pursue projects at wet lab benches. In the end is a balance between people being able to learn for each other but not competing with each other for the same products and the same customers. So that actually two people can be working on very practically similar R&D projects that will wind up producing, for example, a new bioreactor for producing biofuels for alternative energy cars. And the same research can lead to a more consistent uh, fermentation vessel for, for, you know, for example, to launch a brewery. I'm Dan. I'm Director of Technology and Operations at TBD Brewing. I think that uh, being in Cambridge, being next to Cambridge, is basically the best place that we could start a science-oriented brewery um, just because of how many resources, MIT and Harvard and dozens of other schools that um, have so much activity in microbiology and other sciences around here. I think that uh, brewing beer is the best way to teach adults science. This is Ron Friedlander and I'm the Director of Microbiology and Finance at TBD Brewing. Scientific things can we do? How else can we approach fermentation? Uh, and, you know, and then we started thinking about uh, existing tech incubators like Y Combinator is one we, we think about a lot, we talk about a lot because they have a very good model. And we thought, well, how could we take something like that and use it for something like fermentation-based technologies? And has anyone done anything like this? And it seems like no one's done anything close to this, as far as we can tell. I mean, there are people doing research in fermentation, but generally in sort of university settings or, or commercial settings that are, you know, proprietary research. But this is sort of more of an open way of doing it. We're going to be in a place where we can have sort of a high margin, uh, but lower volume, at least initially, um, type of model. And then we're hoping that based on the modeling we've done and, and how much we think we can sell on site and what our, what our margin is on that, we think we can start to accumulate money. And some of that money can be put towards uh, as small investments in some of these uh, potential startups in the people who would be in our accelerator space. Davis Square is a mecca for local foods in greater Boston. Davis Square has 10,000 people a day that come through the subway station, that go visit its farmer's markets, that go to its 15, 20 bars in two blocks, and it doesn't have a brewery. Davis Square needs a brewery.